Hey gamers, welcome to Gamer Guy Channel. I am Rollin at Robocraft, and I, we just had a new patch hit for the Mega SMG, so I figured I'd uh, log on and share that with you. Let's run over to the tech tree here and see what we got. Here it is, the new Mega uh, TX1 launcher. Do I want to unlock that? 815 uh, tier 10 points, I could do that. So we got that unlocked now. Now, this thing does 10,331 damage, but it shoots two shots. So it ends up uh, with a 20,662 total damage per shot on it, so that's pretty cool. Let's take a look here at the uh, depot and uh, see how much they cost to buy them. Oh, got a little far here. Here they are, so they're about a million each. Well, I think it's just about somewhat real similar to uh, what the uh, Mega SMG is, yeah, same price. And uh, so let's buy a few. All right, let's put them on and see how they look. I think I can afford five right now. Almost six. I, I might as well sell something to get my six. What's up, guys? We're going to try recording this one more time. I've tried a couple times to capture uh, me in a match with the PX1 Plasma. But for some reason, every time I record on the different uh, visual settings, I get a uh, real low frame rate. So I'm thinking there might be a problem with that uh, as far as using some kind of recording software for it. So I put it on fastest, which is the crappiest graphics basically available. And uh, so far, so good. Haven't seen any uh, problems yet. So that might be the answer. And yeah, we're still recording at 30 frames a second, so that's cool. Someone got a new Mega Stick design. That's cool. Alright, and we got ourselves, our Mega here on the uh, right side. The thing I do like about the new plasmas is you can trace better, you know, where you shot and uh, then make adjustments where you need to. Right, they do a pretty good job of uh, getting into the enemy too and pouring them out. Not sure if I like them better than the uh, Mega SMGs, but I mean they're doing it. They're doing their job. There we go. Did a little flip. <laughs> of course, got uh, my team underneath my wheels as always. Well, my initial impressions of the uh, TX1 is that they're pretty good, but I don't think I'd pick them over the Mega SMGs. This is my opinion. I see myself still doing more damage with the Mega SMGs, but these things did uh, kill tier 10 enemies rather well, and I can see these being very useful for a bomber if you have that secondary shot. I think they look pretty good, but what do you guys think? Do you like the way they turned out? Do you like the 10% uh, uh, reduction of damage to plasmas overall? I actually think that's not such a bad thing. Plasmas were pretty powerful uh, before they uh, did this adjustment of this last patch, so now I think they're probably going to be about right. Uh, but I think these probably could have standed just a little bit more power, honestly, with the X1s. A little bit underwhelming. I think maybe if you get uh, more on uh, your robots, you have some redundancy. That might help a little bit. Uh, but right now I'm just using six. Anyway, so that was just a sneak peek at what these plasmas uh, are like. There might still be a couple modifications I do, of course. We've still got a long way to go before this game even uh, goes live. You know, we're still in alpha. So, anyway guys, thanks a lot for checking out my channel. Please come back soon for some more builds and let's plays. And if you uh, have not subscribed, please do so. And I'll see you guys real soon here on Gamer Guy Channel.